leg day. Oh yes, it's leg day once again, one of the toughest and the most uncomfortable workouts of the week in my opinion. Uh, I'm still using antagonist supersets, performing a pushing and a pulling movement back to back in supersets. In this case, I'm using a leg press uh, with leg curls. Uh, I usually do squats, but had access to a leg press at the gym here and decided to give it a shot. Uh, lately, I've been experimenting with pulsed repetitions. That's basically performing a full repetition and at the bottom of every rep, performing a half rep before finishing it. And what this does is it really increases the time under tension and brings that muscle to complete fatigue. This is gonna really lead to some serious leg gains. If you can handle the burn and, and push through that discomfort, I recommend you give this technique a try. So for example, here I'm performing the leg curl all the way up, halfway down, and pulsing it back up before I lower it under control for a full range repetition. So that was my superset for leg presses and leg curls. And next I'm moving on to walking lunges. I'm going to be pairing these up with stiff leg deadlifts for the hammies. So with the walking lunge, again, lowering it down all the way, small pulse, and then back up for a full repetition. The key is to really control the negative or the descent, the lowering phase of every repetition, and then squeeze hard on the way up. So here I am pulsing at the bottom of every rep of the stiff leg deadlift. Now one thing to recognize with pulse reps is you may have to lower the weight that you use slightly to be able to perform the repetitions you want to get through. It's a lot tougher than it looks. And I'm finishing off with calves, one of my weak areas for sure. But I uh, figured they had a couple of cool uh, calf machines at the gym and I take advantage of that. So donkey calf raises here for the straight leg calf raise. And again, using the pulse repetitions here for a really good serious calf burn. And I'm going to be supersetting that with uh, seated calf raises. So give this technique a try at your next leg workout and post a comment down below. Let me know what you think. If you liked the video, give it a like. Make sure you subscribe for more. Until next time, stay strong.